Hey guys, so we made it to an ice cave. We actually drove to Washington and I forgot what town we're in, but we are at some ice caves and it looks intense and it feels, it's hot outside, but it feels really cold next to the cave. And it says that there's bats here. And so yeah, let's check it out. It'll be really dark, but good thing we brought flashlights and jackets. It is ice cold here and we still haven't entered and it is pitch dark so we have to use our flashlights and we're going into this frozen tundra apparently there's ice Okay, so we just went through the caves and there was like ice everywhere and you could like walk through and there's like frozen pieces of like icicles and stuff but we didn't make it all the way through because it's really big and it got really really narrow and I also fell on my hand but I'm okay thankfully and so let's see where else sorry so let's see where else we can go Welcome back to my channel. Be sure to click that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up. And let's go explore. <laughs> Good morning, guys. So we drove like 8 to 10 hours. I am not sure because I kind of fell asleep. We got here like around 2 or 3 in the morning. And so today we're going to go explore in Lassen Park. And yeah, our bear is still alive hasn't like flown off the roof or anything and we're gonna go see all like the volcanoes the geysers and everything that there is and we're back in california new adventure off to bernie falls so we have about a one mile easy walk so and we can see the waterfall from here so we're just walking down to see it and it should be really really pretty So right now, we have to go all the way down there and just zigzag all the way down. Okay, so we just left the waterfall and we actually got a ticket but now we are in Lassen National Park and we're just going to check out what is going on and we're kind of helping, well, we're kind of, there's like a car behind us that got stuck and they're like out there, the guys are helping them to get out, hopefully. Okay, so this van ended up getting stuck in this ditch and it was like stuck here for a while and the people said that they had been stuck for a while and no one stopped to help them out so good thing we stopped 
And as you can see, they tied up these orange cables that they had and they were trying to pull the span out of there, but the cables ended up being too weak and you'll see right now that it just snaps. So good thing we had these stronger yellow cables and so we were able to put this on the van. So these cables are the ones that we tied up the mattress and the bear with, but we had extra ones. So we just tied up the van and luckily we were able to get them out and yeah, enjoy the rest of the park. And so they also got to enjoy the rest of the park too and hopefully didn't get stuck anywhere else. We're gonna check out the volcanoes and stuff and we're at this lake. I forgot what it's called, but it's something creek, I think, or something lake. And it is really nice and it looks really blue. There's all these like purple wildflowers here. Okay, so this is crazy. So this rock was like on some giant volcano and the glacier melted and landed right here. And we're trying to get to that giant smoky area over there. And it's like a 1.2 mile walk, but it looks way further than that. So that might not be it. Okay, so we made it to the bottom of the boardwalk and it says that the water is from molten rocks and it's 464 degrees underneath, but on the surface it's about 200 degrees and honestly I feel like someone could accidentally burn them so it's like right there. So yeah, let's see what else we see. Thanks for watching, be sure to subscribe and part 3 is coming soon.